Hello, this is Pamela. Welcome to my channel. Grab you a cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and enjoy some good old yarny talk. Hello, this is Pamela, and you're on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. Welcome to my channel. Um, if you are new to my channel, my channel is mostly all about crochet, but every now and then I do throw in a few other things, other crafts and stuff. Um, so yeah, but today's video is the Monday Crochet Chat video, and I like to start that off the beginning of the week to kind of show you guys what I've been doing the last part of the week before and over the weekend. <laughs> um, so I do have a few things. I've made, uh, let's see, two scarves, one hat, um, I think maybe a, um, a chalet and to come on here tomorrow. My daughter, we're going to the baby gender reveal. And of course I know what it is. It's going, it's my second baby, but I'm not telling you guys until tomorrow. So I did work on, I made a hat, some baby mittens, a pair of booties, um, Let's see, I guess that may be it. Hat, baby booties, um, mittens. Yeah. Anyway, I made that as a set. And then I made a baby blanket with a little stuffed animal. <laughs> and so um, I did it in the colors, you know, like for the reveal. So anyway, I'll be giving those tonight, this afternoon, at the baby gender reveal party. So I'm so excited. Um, I'm going to be a Gigi again. <laughs> Um, I do have one daughter, and this is, you know, the second child. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty excited. But, yeah, I'll, I'll come on here tomorrow, and I'll let you guys know what it's going to be. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get started today's video. Grab you something to drink. I am drinking, um, this was from one of you subscribers, lovely friends out there, uh, Starbucks um, vanilla coffee. I am still drinking that. And um, this coffee cup was actually given to me as a set of four, and I just love them. Well, this is cup three. I've showed you guys two of the cups. This is three. Uh, I want to show you the pretty flower on the back. They all have something different on the back of them like that. Isn't that just cool? But here it is. Okay, so let me turn it around. Uh, John 3, 16. Whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. And I think the way I always remember was have e everlasting life, but eternal life, it's excellent. But anyway, so this is what I'm drinking today. So grab your cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and let's just see the items that I have gotten finished. Mm, it is so good in the mornings. <laughs> Shannon, I told you she gave me a really big box, and I was just going to show some things um, throughout my videos. Well, this is one of the packages that I received from her. And look, pencils! And I am needing some more pencils. So, thank you, Shannon, for that. So, here's one of the things right here. And it has this kind of paper in it like this, which that is good for people like me who design stuff because I draw my things out. So, um, thank you so much for that. I love this. A set of pencils. Look at there. And then this right here, this is stitch markers. I am going to share these with my sister, Tanya. I didn't let her take any yet because I showed her, you know, that I'd like to show it in the video before I split them with her. But she does use this kind. I have never used this kind before. So I'm going to try these out. Um, but she um, loves this. So I'm definitely splitting these with her. <laughs> and, and this right here says multi-bomb. Um, extremely moisturizing for dry skin and lips. <laughs> and then there's some hand cream. There's some lemon tea. And two crochet hooks. Look at that. And I like that they're flat right here. I love that. So, and the shaft is short. I like the short shafts. <laughs> uh, this one is a ten and a half. I do not have a 10 and a half, but I do now. And this is an H hook, a 5.0, and I was needing another H hook. Thank you so much for that. I have one left. Some of mine are in projects, but I have one that, like for projects that I know I'm going to be finished, like finishing like real quick. Um, I have one and I'm like constantly make trying to make sure I don't put it in a project or something because <laughs> it's all I had. So, uh, thank you for that. It's just what I needed. 
Okay, so here's one of the things I finished. This is uh, my, actually my bobble stitch scarf. I did this in gray. And this is just a granny stitch hat. Right here. With the pom-pom on it. So, yeah, I love this. And this has been washed. So, yeah, I'll leave the link below of the pattern to this. The yarn that I used for this, I had this much left over. Um, there was a little bit already taken out of this skein, but it wasn't much. So, it was pretty much a full skein. But this is Craft Smart Never Enough 100% Acrylic uh, Medium 4 Weight. And the color should be light gray, I believe. Yeah, light gray, 716 yards. But, like I said, it wasn't quite a full skein. Yep, there it is. It is so easy to make, guys. Um, I did do something slightly different. You know how it is. We all do this, right? Um, I did my first row. I did put a single crochet on my chain before I started my bobble stitches, and then I ended it right here with single crochet. Uh, I did not do that in the tutorial, but I did that for this. Okay, so these are the two chalets. Uh, they are the same size. This looks like it hangs down lower. It's just a smaller uh, form and um, also a little shorter, so. <laughs> Uh, they're actually the same size. 21 inches, I believe, by the middle. The wingspan is 43. Anyway, something like that. But they're just shawlettes. They're not full shawls. So this is basically kind of how I wear them. But um, these are in my Etsy shop. Uh, I do have a tutorial on these as well, if you want to make your own. It's called Shawl and a Ball Shawlette. I'll leave these in the description box. But, um, yeah, that's the two that I have in my Etsy shop. Okay, and this I also have in my Etsy shop. And I just think it's beautiful. Look at this. I love these colors. I got these colors from the uh, Crochet Calendar. Let's see. There it is. The Crochet Calendar. Now, the Scenic Beauty Crochet Along with the Yarny Fiber Sisters. <laughs> oh, gosh, I don't know why that was a mouthful, but I guess it's so early in the morning, maybe. <laughs> but anyway, I pulled the colors from that right there, that calendar, or that scene right there. Isn't it beautiful? Anyway, and so I decided, well, you know what? I think I'm just going to go ahead and put this one in my Etsy shop, put it up for sale, but that's it right there. Isn't it just beautiful? Okay, let's look at the colors. Okay, I'm not sure what the gold is, but I think it may be Premier Basic. And then that's Premier Basic here for the pink. It's called Taffy. Big Twist. Should be olive green and it should be rust. They're all 100% acrylic. So those are the colors that I put together for that calendar. Okay, guys, let's do our 365 days of prayer. Resource of hope. Encourage the hearts of your fellow believers and support one another just as you have already been doing. 1 Thessalonians 5, 11. Great God, you have every resource at your disposal. When I am running close to empty, I know that you have what I need to be filled up. What a wonderful open invitation. Even so, you have set us in families and communities. I am so incredibly grateful for the support of my brothers and sisters in the kingdom. When I am discouraged, I find solace in their company. When I feel alone and I reach out, I realize that my situation is not isolated. I find encouragement that my heart needs in sharing life, the struggles, victories, and everything in between. Thank you for flesh and blood spiritual family that can support me in my weaknesses. As I learn to love like you, Father, the road is bumpy but worth it. I am grateful for the hope that grows in me as I watch others' prayers 
being answered. As we call on your name together, you reach out and encourage us with each other. What a wonder. When the going gets tough, as it does sometimes with family, keep us bound together in your love that perseveres. How does being with other believers strengthen your hope in the Lord? It is amazing. guys that's all that i have for this video uh like i said stay tuned tomorrow and um i will let you know the sex of the baby and uh she's due in january so i'm excited about that um yeah i believe that's all that i have um wednesday will be wednesday whip caddy video if you have any whip caddies or any cartoon thing and you want to show off the things that you're working on please uh post pictures in my facebook group page um, so that I can include those in to, uh, Wednesday's video. So, yeah, that's all that I have, guys. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.